So, you know, experts are always saying that we need to get more sleep and find a way to really uh, get rest. And the challenge is in this fast paced world, it's really kind of something that's really difficult for people to do and kind of gets put on the back burner. Now, I know I've talked before about sleep and the importance of getting that seven plus hours of sleep, but I want to talk a little bit more about what I mean by rest and sleep, you know, because uh, we're learning more and more about in your health. Uh, that the kind of these rest periods are extremely important. So I want to talk to you a little bit about some of the benefits of finding these rest periods. So the first benefit is, you know, your your heart health will improve. So, you know, when I talk about rest, I'm not, I'm not just talking about sleeping, but I'm talking about taking breaks from kind of your daily stressful uh, situations in your life. So rest is going to allow your blood pressure to become lower. It's going to uh, really give your heart a chance to kind of slow down. Um, and this is one of the importance of, of really getting that adequate sleep uh, because it really helps to kind of help regulate our heart, but also fend off heart disease and strokes. Another benefit of rest is basically it can reduce the stress on your body. You know, the kind of the constant stress of our daily lives really leaves us kind of in this heightened state of anxiety, which really has a, a negative effect on our immune system. And Really, if we can get some regular rest, this is going to help lower our stress and also the stress hormones associated with that, uh, which is very beneficial, specifically with our immune system. Another benefit of rest is you really become more creative. You know, creative breakthroughs really happen when you kind of least expect them. Uh, your, your creativity may be actually lacking because you haven't been taking a break for a while. And, and quiet moments of relaxation kind of lets your brain rest. And this will allow you to be more creative. Productivity, another benefit is you actually become more productive. Uh, you know, productivity isn't about who can work the most hours. It's really about who can make the most of each hour. So, you know, taking a break really helps your mind reset. It can re-energize your body and really helps you operate at peak performance. Another benefit of rest is really you can get in touch with your kind of your non-work self. You know, the old adage of all work and no play, we know, we know what this say this statement is. And it really, you know, makes you one dimensional if you really are always focused on work and you kind of lose who you are. So it's important to schedule some time to really allow you to rest and really discover your own identity and that you're not just your career, uh, but you're actually other things. And this really helps you learn other things about yourself. Another benefit of rest is you can be, you'll become more fit. So, you know, rest and sleep really gives your body that time to recharge. So proper uh, rest is essential for uh, uh, helping us so we have fewer energy uh, injuries if we're, when we're exercising. We're going to have more energy to power kind of through our, our day. Another benefit of rest is you can really experience deeper relationships. So, you know, this kind of the fast-paced lifestyles that we live, uh, really uh, has a, an impact, most often a negative impact, on spending time with the ones we love. So, you know, if you take the afternoon off or even if you take the entire day off, to really allow you to kind of slow down, be in the moment with your family, and you're really going to find that you can enjoy, enjoy each other's company that's going to create some deeper bonds. Another benefit of rest is really it increases your ability to handle kind of the life's emergencies. Crisis happen, we all know that. And, and when they do, your body will react. And if you're already kind of this heightened state of stress, you're going to make poor decisions. You may become emotional. And resting really kind of gives you that reserve to handle things that are, may come up later, and you're going to handle them better. So, so rest, again, is something important. Another benefit is you're going to solve problems better. Now, your brain solves problems better after a break from kind of this bombardment of outside influences. So, you know, don't try to force it, you know, next time you need to find a solution, you know, just maybe take some time and rest. So what are some steps you can take today? Well, the first thing you can do is go to your calendar and really schedule some time that's rest time, schedule an afternoon off or even a whole day. Now, use this, this time to rest. That doesn't necessarily mean sleep. Again, 
uh, sleep is important, uh, but I'm also talking about other rest periods. So during these, these times, you may, you know, kind of treat yourself to reading a book, catching up with family. Another action step is really just set a timer for 25 minutes. So when you're doing kind of focused work, uh, work on that work, that whatever it is you're working on for that 25 minutes, and then take a five to 10 minute break. This is going to really give you energy to kind of get through that project. So uh, frequent small breaks is also one of those things that I'm talking about uh, for rest. And then the uh, uh, final action step is really put your phone in the drawer for 24 hours. You know, enjoy time without this kind of the steady stream of distractions that really actually increase your, your stress significantly. So remember, you know, it's important to take care of yourself. And so one of the things we can do is really focus on these periods of rest uh, throughout our day and, and making sure we're getting adequate sleep. So again, you know, you're on your health journey and hopefully you find some of these items helpful and you can apply them to your lives. Anyway, if you need anything from us, just let us know. Thank you.